Sugarcane produces sugar, which is an important source of energy and fuel for our bodies. But there's more to sugarcane than just sugar. Well, Pure Cane is the sweetener consumer brand from Emery's. And Rebam is our hero ingredient, which is naturally derived from sugar cane. And it is responsible for giving the taste like sugar and no calories. I mean, it's science powered by nature. Rebam has been known for at least 10 years as the best tasting molecule from the stevia plant. It's found naturally in stevia. Everyone wanted it, but it was not really available because the stevia plant makes so little of it. It's a tiny, tiny, tiny fraction of all the sweet molecules that are in the stevia plant. You could never grow enough plants and purify this molecule because it's so little, it would take too much time and energy and money and you just, you couldn't do it. So Amara said, we can do this. We can engineer yeast to make Reb-M at really high purity using a simple fermentation process, the same way you make beer or wine. All of our inputs are just sugar and water. And sugar is a renewable source. Sunlight, carbon dioxide from the air, you grow the sugar cane, you extract the sugar, you feed it to the yeast. Some carbon dioxide goes back into the atmosphere. You start the cycle all over again. The sugar cane um, stalks that get left over after they're crushed. We burn in our facility to generate electricity. We actually give that electricity back to the grid. It's a very challenging project, which is one of the reasons I was very excited to take it on. I can point out, for example, that sugarcane captures a significant amount of carbon. It supports an efficient use of water. It doesn't degrade the soil and it has a short cycle time. And one of the great environmental benefits of sugarcane is the reduction on the emission of the greenhouse gas. By harnessing nature, we're able to make solutions for our world. I mean, there's no question that we are in a crisis right now on our planet. And how are we gonna solve this problem? How are we going to do this? We're going to need lots of different technological solutions and biotechnology is one of those solutions that we're going to need to feed our planet, to protect the few remaining resources we have, to make things more sustainably, to protect our water supply. I want to make a difference in this world. I, I want to, when I die, I want to know that what I worked on made the planet a better place.